Hey, welcome back to Greenhorn Barbecue and Beer. I'm Todd. I'm Sassy, the Kitchen Queen. And if you're new to the channel, this is uh, where we show you how our style of cooking is, and we hope that you learn something from us, or you teach us something back in the comments down below. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell for future information. So it's it's about mid-September uh, by the time you see this video. Um, barbecuing season is coming to a close, except in California. Except in California. <laughs> uh, we can barbecue here year-round. There's probably a few other places you can as well. So Cal sunny weather. We take advantage of some of the sales at the end of the season uh, and we can continue on grilling. And one of the things that we got here is this Cuisinart griddle. Um, it's kind of a poor man's Evo. Um, this is on sale at a local box store for about 175 bucks. Uh, yes, it's gas, but it's uh, basically a round black stone, if you will. And where it kind of drains off all around the edges, it's kind of curved. Um, so it's pretty neat. Um, it's small, it's compact. It's about, uh, I don't know, 30,000 BTU or something like that. And we're gonna go ahead and unbox it and show you what's inside. Okay, so one thing about this box is it's pretty heavy. Um, it's gonna take two average strength adults to uh, get this into your truck and out of the store. So definitely ask for some assistance when you're, uh, when <laughs> you're getting it. Look what it comes with. Um, well, no, these are actually uh, oh, accessories. That accessories. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, right off the bat, it looks like it's packaged pretty well. Um, we've got these little notices. Let's see that again. With the instruction manual and everything, why do you just throw things? Okay. As expected, there's a lot of sheet metal with this thing. Okay. Okay, flimsy. Okay, looks like some more parts. Lots of sheet metal on this. This looks like the bit part of the upper part of the base. Looks like uh, we got the uh, the lid comes inside of uh, a couple other things. Okay, put this over here. Okay, so this looks like the lid. Pretty neat. Some legs. Yeah, it looks like we got the burner assembly, which is pretty nice. All right, looks like it's packaged really well. Got some hoses. Looks like it's, everything's packed away really well. We've got these legs. Some of these casters. They look all right. Okay. This looks like the Low pressure regulator. Okay, everything looks packaged really well. Uh, nothing really looks damaged. So where's the part that goes on top of that? Okay, so babe, Queenie, grab that side. And there we go. 
And there we go, as you can see. That's the uh, main controller. And this looks like the grill. Okay, pretty nice looking griddle, looks like it's got some bracing or whatever, not sure how thick that is, it's not quarter inch but uh, pretty thick. Okay, it looks like the uh, hardware is in this little box right here, take a peek in there. Okay. okay, it looks like we got uh, some hardwares, nicely packaged, and we got the knobs. And more brackets. More hardware. Drip pan. And more hardware. Okay. Paperwork looks pretty legit. Seems to have some easy to read instructions. Doesn't look difficult at all. Looks like some standard screwdrivers and uh, quite a few parts. Doesn't look like any. <laughs> Doesn't look like any Allen uh, nuts at all. But uh, I'm gonna get started and assemble this thing and we'll get back to you in a little bit. take to uh, put that together about 20 minutes yeah, about 20 minutes or so um, a lot of allen screws uh, a lot of washers um, it's got that nice little griddle on the top um, it's got two zones you know I guess left side and the right side and a uh, dinner bell <laughs> that uh, doubles as a lid but uh, that is actually pretty neat, having that uh, steam lid or whatever, you know. It's got, a little, it's got even a little right air uh, vent right there. Not sure what we can smoke on that. 
Nice little table. Underneath the table is a little paper towel rack, which is kind of neat. Not sure what the capacity on that table is. I'm sure somewhere it says it. Um, so it's, it's not bad. Okay, spinning it around. So this little tray here along the edge collects the grease and then there's a little grease catcher just like uh, gas grills have. And uh, <laughs> take off that lid again, babe. So as you can see, maybe you can't see, but that griddle top is actually curved. It's got a dome kind of to it. So the grease uh, goes off into this uh, circular grease pan. Huh. And the higher end units uh, like Evo and some other companies that are well over $3,000, uh, they're stainless steel. It even ha it has a little hook in here too yep. to hang the lid. I don't know where you hang it. Right on the edge. Is this the right place? Yep, right on the edge. Okay, how come it's got a hole in it? Oh. There you go. Well, it must hang somewhere else if it's got a hole in it. Uh, sure, it's all right. So one little uh, minor complaint I have is uh, the, the gas. The gas line doesn't seem really long enough to me. It's, it's kind of short. Kind of short and it's just kind of like, you know, I had to kind of like bend it and it's, it's really kind of, on the edge there. So maybe a taller uh, bottle or, or some, some kind of uh, base to, to lift that up. And it's got this little um, little rack thingamajigger there. I don't even know what I can use that, but that's supposed to take some of the strain off the hose. And then a match holder. Um, Guys, hit me up in the uh, description or in the comments. Tell me uh, what the hell kind of match holder is that. So, all right, that's a match holder. And uh, hold on, I have one more thing. Okay, don't look. Oh yeah. Take that to your cover. Oh, that cover. You never buy covers. You always buy the gadgets, and you never buy the covers. All right. <laughs> all right, there we go. There's the unboxing of the Quizenart. Uh, yeah circular griddle and uh, poor man's evo is what i'm going to call it poor uh, man's evo. so we're going to go oh, ahead a nice cover yeah. can we make something right now oh uh, well maybe some burgers oh, it says so anyway this is no plug to cuisinart or, or parent companies or anything like that we just wanted a uh, cheap circular griddle we've been seeing them on some other channels and uh we saw it on sale we decided to go get it so uh we're going to go ahead and uh take a break now and I think we're going to cook, uh, I don't know, some sliders or something. So, Burgers, anyway, sliders, something. See you later. Anyway, hope you enjoy. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe, share this video, and uh, hit up the description for any links to this uh, griddle itself. If you're interested in picking yourself one up or any other gadgets we have on the show. Yeah, they're on sale. So, anyway, see you later.